Hi everyone, welcome back to Yellow Cottage Soapery. Today I am restocking Rainbow Sherbert Soap. So I have a range of all the different colors of the rainbow that I'm going to use to color it with. I'm going to have a white base and I do plan on doing a little bit of piping on the top. Nothing, nothing major, just some, something simple I think. So I already have my kaolin clay in here. I have not blended it yet, so I'm going to do that right now. And then I'm going to go ahead and add my lye solution and separate out my six different colors.
we're going to go ahead and pipe on the top. I put each of the colors in a Wilton, with a Wilton 12 tip. It's one of the larger circle tips. And I'm just going to uh, make dots. So I debated if I should go straight across or diagonal. I think I'm going to just go straight across. So all I'm going to do is hold my piping bag straight up and just keep squeezing all the way across. And then I'll switch to the next color and so on. since I have made this soap and I'm going to go ahead and cut it now and that's kind of what it looks like from the side of the loaf. I already cut the, the end loaf so this is the one in the center. Oh, it smells so good. I like that all the colors are showing. I wasn't sure if that was going to be the case just because of um, how I had to pour it. It got a little bit thick which normally this fragrance doesn't do. I was a little surprised. I think it might have just been the temperature of my oils and my lye that made it set up quicker because this fragrance usually actually slows down trays quite a bit and I usually have to wait a while to pipe it. But with this one I was able to just start piping right away. I love how that kind of looks like waves on the top there. I made four soaps. Um, the day I made this, I made four total, so I have three more to cut, and then um, get the videos edited so I can put them up on my on this channel. My daughter's been doing some of the editing for me, um, but she works at Medieval Times. She's a bartender, so she's working a lot now. Um, that summer's here, and they do two shows a day. So, she's busy, so I hate to ask her, so I either have to learn more about it myself and do it on the new um, iMovie that I am using. I was wanting to come out yesterday and cut these, but... We had some uh, rain and some wind from Claudette. Not bad or anything, but 
it was just kind of dark and dreary all day, so I knew the camera filming wouldn't be great. And last cut. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you all in the next video.